<laughs> I never forget uh, when Ronnie was born, and I, I had him at Fry's Hospital, and uh, my sister-in-law came up, and she said, she said, she went home and she told my mother-in-law, Benny stepped out this time. She got a white man's baby. And so, and so the nurse came in. It was another girl that I went to school with. She had a baby. Well, her little baby was very, very, very dark. But Ronnie did look, and he had, he had light, pretty eyes. And he had one little crane of hair sticking in the, up in the top of his head. And so the nurse brought him in, and so she said, oh, I'm sorry, this isn't your baby. And so so I told her, I said, let me see it. And she looked at, she looked at, Ron, I looked at Ronnie, I said, I said, that's my son. He look, I said, he's light, but he looks just like my husband. And, and, and so that lady was supposed to get off at 3.30. She stayed, she, she would come to see me at the hospital, the hospital about 5 to 5.30. She stayed, she stayed off, she stayed on the job until she saw my husband. And she couldn't believe it. But he, he looked just like me. He was just real fake. So, so Mr., Mr. What was it? What was Mr. Jones? That live next door to us, Mr. Neal was his name, and and uh, so I was sitting running out in the out in the yard in his playpen, cause I got so tired of everybody saying he was white. Well, they didn't tell me that he was real light until he got ten years old. But anyway, Mr. Mr. Neal used to come out and he would always take pictures of running. He said, my gosh, when is this boy going to get brown? So Mr. C Mrs. Neal, I mean, uh, he said, Mr. Neal, I didn't turn my color until I was 10 years old. He said, I was real fair, too. <laughs> and Mr. Neal said, what? You mean he going he gonna to stay that light? And Ronnie did stay light for a long time. But I used to sit running out in the front yard in his in his walker not walker, in his in his little playpen. And and he said, Why are you sitting that boy out there like that? Because I want him to get brown. I'm tired of people asking me if he's <laughs> he's white or not. And then lo here comes Keith. Keith looked like a Mexican. Now Felicia when she was born she was the color of my husband and my mother-in-law. And, and then Greg, Greg had hit that a nice color. He wasn't dark or light. And, uh, but Ronnie was white. And Keith was a man, he's a third when he looked like a Mexican. And, and then, uh, then they come Ronnie looking like a white man's baby. Then my last one, uh she was she was a nice color too and, uh, but i always prayed that my kids would all be the same color because i did not want them to be prejudiced against each other and and i was so happy when runny turned he finally started getting the color <laughs>